Hi guys, welcome to this video about how to search for a text in any kind of documents in a specific folder. I've made already another video, you will find that on my channel. It got uh, quite lengthy, so I try to keep this one much, much shorter. Okay, we are here on a folder and we want to search for content in this file. As you can see, there's 777 in both of these files. As you can see here, 777. When we just enter 777 here, it doesn't find anything because it's just searching for file names and file um, like description and, and those things. So how can we... Uh, do this we type here content uh, double point seven 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 and we find it but just in one file that's the txt file and not in the php file so why is that so we have to go to the index options we press windows type index and here we are here we have all the locations which are indexed. We can modify the locations. We, now we don't lo want the locations. We want the file type. So we go to the advanced, go to file type, and we look for PHP because the other one is a PHP. Here we have the PHP. If it's not here, we can add, just write PHP and add. So here you have to make sure that it's checked. And here we have the um the attribute of this and it says index properties only we have to change that to index property and file content we um yeah we click okay another time okay and close is not possible because it's it's updating in the background it needs a couple of seconds usually till we can close that and now just watch what it's showing here when we uh, refresh that i hope it already works sometimes it takes some time we click on refresh here and as you can see now it finds also the 777 as a content here in the php so whatever uh, you want to have searched you have to have an extension in the index option so we need actually both we need to type content double point and then the uh, search string um, yeah if we have this folder added in the indexing options we don't have to write content um, yeah if we if we if we don't have it like in my case I don't want it because it uses a lot of CPU and space and so on I just keep it keep it clean and I write content 777 but I added uh, the PHP extension so that's it for now that was much shorter i hope i was able to help you a little bit with that if you have any questions or comments just write to the comment section below i'm always happy to talk about these things and by the way yeah if you need the longer version just check and i no, i i will put down the link to the longer version into the description so you can see the whole thing if you need a little bit more more details and more time so i hope i was able to help you a little bit with that if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching see you next time